Hi guys, this is Patty again. By the way, I wanted to tell you, this is my new summer wig. It's called Allure in 12 FS8, of course, my shaded praline. And this is a petite. Allure comes in petite, average, large, monotop, regular wig. This is just a regular wig. The price point is fantastic. This is a must-do for your summer. Okay. I've shown you in a video prior how to get the dirty bang and how to cut it and so forth and so on. Now I want to show you on the same Julia how to cut the back. I'm going to turn it around for you because this is close as how we did the dirty bang. If you come around and you put your canvas, your head, make sure that it's always straight and you've got the wig pinned on. Remember those pins across the lace here to keep that? Two right here at the ear tabs and two right at the back. So it's really nice and even. I even put one right there so I can kind of see that it's always on straight. Just my own little trick. Now, this wig is multi kind of layered down here at the bottom. It's the layer, then it gets a little layer down here. And it's great. I'll tell you, it's great for, for young moms. It's great for young moms that, that still want the long hair, but that you can pull back like this, twist it when you're cleaning the kids off with food all over their face. So, I want to show you another little way you can do it. Say the bottom's getting frizzed and it's not looking really good. So you're going to brush it. That's the most important thing. The brushing and the combing. Remember, I've always said comb for 10 minutes, cut for two. Now, if this looks familiar, it's the same kind of combing that I did for the dirty bang. Now I'm going to pull down here. I hope you can see this, V. Okay. I'm coming down here. See where this is all kind of frizzy and messy and I don't want it like that anymore, but I don't want it straight either. So I twisted it just like I did the bang. Can you see that? I'm coming down here where the twist is. Now this is a little bit harder, especially for my little arthritic fingers. And I want it to be straight across, remember, straight across. So I'm going to go keep going. Until you get it straight, babe, because then what happens is it unravels and it's shorter in the back and it's longer on the sides, just by a little. Can you see that? I'll go to the side. See how this is a little bit shorter and then it comes down. If you don't like that, you can always snip it off, but that really is a nice look. And that's how you cut off the back to make a shorter wig. Have a great day.